special feeling there though that you have that ability to give her a little hug with your leg and connect her out to the bit there yep out to the bit right and just riding that again like on your circle line saying yep just gradually pushing her a little off of that inside leg to the full circle because that's one thing as a young horse they all feel a little tilty to the inside so you can kind of teach her there yeah inside leg needs to move over super Ava right good not too fast thinking about reaching instead of speed say I want longer strides where you let out more of your tension actually there you go those strides Full circle, that's it. Good, Ava. And then when you're ready, up to the canter this side. And just saying, again, if you're just looking for a slow transition, quiet, but she just kind of falls into the canter. Good girl. Right, balance. Go ahead and take it a little large. Right, super. Yeah, and there you can say to her, just massage the bit a little that she's not super high and inside out because that unbalances her. So just say there, I do need to make her just a little rounder on my outside. Yeah, massage that outside rein a little. There you go. Right, just so that you actually capture her shoulder a little there. Nice, Ava, good, bring it large. Oh, it's okay. Yep, take your time. And those, like there, just make it very simplistic. Like find a good trot for a sec, don't rush. Just find another good transition. Say it's an opportunity to have another good transition. Yeah, trotting on. A little more outside rain. So there's a little too much pull to the inside there. There you go. Good. Yeah, and canter. Keep your outside rain. Good, go large. Keep your outside rain. Look ahead and go forward to that outside rain. Keeping the outside. Yep. Right. That's your balance point, that outside. 